My name is Ramesh Venkateswamy. I'm a T TCD graduate from the year 1994. Um, since then, I've been working in the industry for the last 21 years. Uh, I have done works with menswear, branding called Periellis Menswear for 10 years, women's wear, Tracy Reese Contemporary Women's Wear for a few years, and then my last assignment was I was working for the number one blanket company for home, Berkshire Blanket. And then my new assignment is I'm my own boss for the last six months. So it's a, it's a brand that I'm launching after collegiate sports, but it's not totally sports. It's performance outerwear for men's. So that's where I currently am. Well, um, Nebraska was the first place I came when I uh, came from India. So it was a big culture shock in terms of, it's a good, in a good way. So the first snow I, sna I saw, it was in Nebraska. Uh, first time I hear country music was in Nebraska. Pickup truck, I still want a pickup truck today. That's because of Nebraska. Those are all personal stuff. On the, on the study side, I was very, you know, I got a lot of education on textile science, so I knew how to design and make a product from why are we choosing this fiber and what sort of that sort of things. And the staff here motivated me to learn more about the US and how things are done in the retail sector, so that helped me a lot to go outside in the big business world to survive. So that's a good part, yeah. And my, my, um, not current CEO, last CEO, he's from Iowa City. He always tells, this is God's country. So people have great value and work ethics. That's one thing I learned from Nebraska. I would watch that for any day. The biggest thing is technology. They have to adapt to new technology. Um, it's just not in our industry, it's in every industry. And technology is developing fast. And we have to adapt or we get left behind. That's one thing. Two, uh, for students to graduate and go to the real world, they have to be strong. They have to take things not personal and face criticism in a positive manner. And then, you know, go for it, you know. And then I personally would like to recommend all the students in the small cities, especially in Nebraska, Lincoln, go out there, explore. There's nothing wrong and you don't, you know, there is, everybody out there is not bad, you know. There's a lot of opportunities out there. And you should uh, know that because you never know who you work for in the future. It could be a Chinese company, it could be Indian company, it could be European, anybody, it doesn't matter. The best thing about Nebraska, uh, obviously, it's a little slow paced. So it's a great thing when you come to a country first time from outside. It's a good time to come to a town that's much more friendly and accommodating. Um, so the same thing applies to students who are going to school in Nebraska that, that want to go and explore their big city like New York City or Los Angeles or Milan or Paris. Um, take a step and go to the biggest city, small biggest city, do some work part time or whatever, get to know and then you get rid of all your fears and then explore. That's the one way to do it, take small baby steps. And that, that's what I think, yeah. And I think no matter, no matter what they teach, it's up to that person to adopt and, you know, go do things. Nobody can force you to do anything you don't want to do. It's the fear that's stopping you to do things, I think. You just have to go take that first step and everything will be fine. Great school and there's a lot of new things, there's a lot of investments that's in terms of new buildings, new architecture, new innovation center that's happening in Nebraska. And the school is still great when it comes to sports, number one in volleyball. And our football team is not doing that shabby this year. So go red, big red, go Huskers.